I'm Bill at Highland Hill Farm, and this is Landon from Sparks Industries. And today he's going to tell you about biochar, a new product that they have. At Highland Hill Farm, we don't buy currently biochar, but we're thinking about buying some to use it. And we're going to be making some videos on how it reacts to uh, the soil when we use it in the soil and how well it does for us. And Brandon, go ahead, tell us about your two grades of biochar. Yeah, absolutely. So we are primarily Sparks Industries. We started off with topsoil. We grew into the mulch and compost. Recently, um, we're getting into biochar because we have an excess of logs. So this is a really great way to uh, reduce the logs that you would have by about 90%. Um, so these are two biochars. They're the same product, just refined to a different coarseness. Um, so this would be our coarse material. So we take the raw, we take the raw material and um, and and pyrolysis is what the process is called. So we have it in a uh, essentially it's a 40 uh, 40 yard container um, with a blower on one side of the machine. Um, it's powered by a diesel motor, and that's just the blower part. We take the logs, put it in the container, and the curtain actually uh, uh, eliminates all the oxygen while the logs are burning. And if you were to have a a fire pit or a um, if you were camping, you would reduce that wood into complete ash. So you would burn the wood in the fire; it would turn into ash. So what we do is we stop that process before the wood can actually turn to ash, and that's what biochar is. The best way to describe this is it's an amendment for your soil, but it's a sponge. So when we uh, when we remove all the nutrients and water in the wood, it, it creates this type of charcoaly matrix, and so it's a honeycomb matrix. And what it does is it holds nine times its weight in water. That's good for your soil because you would amend it one time, and when it rains, it would soak up all that water right into the root zone, and it would slowly release it back into the roots, along with nutrients as well. So the primary source and the primary uh, ingredients in this are whatever you would make out of it actually. So you would charge this with a compost, a liquid fertilizer, you can charge this with pretty much anything and it will soak it all up just like a sponge and it will slowly release wherever you're amending it to. So, okay, now what is the telephone number for Sparks Industries? Yeah, it's 215-345-4481. Uh, okay, and if you can stop in at Highland Hill Farm and see how it's working for us because we're going to be starting to use it to test it out. And we're located on Route 313 in Fountainville in Bucks County. And so we hope to have you come and see how well the biochar works for us so that maybe you might be able to use it as well. My phone number is 215-651-8329. This is Bill at Highland Hill Farm. We're at 5275 Swamp Road, Doylestown.